make sure you've either got elastic, make sure you've got an elastic band, or you've got two, two dumbbells. Okay, so elastic band or two dumbbells. Yes, so, yeah, it's green. Um, before we get going, pin my screen to your main dashboard. So pin my screen to your dashboard, and then I'll talk through Jess's, so, just so we don't get feedback. So pin my screen so you can see me. You should be able to see my whole body workout from here. And then we'll get going. Okay, so please guys, it is quite a it is quite a tough session today. It's an endurance session. If you think about when we run or when we bike, we spend a lot of time in certain positions. So your workload is going to be quite long. It's roughly three minutes of workload, but it, the intensity is going to vary. <clears throat> So pace yourself, you'll understand, and we're going to repeat it a couple of times. There is recovery between, so you're going to have about 30 seconds recovery. Um, yeah, but let's, let's see how it goes. We're going to warm up, we're going to warm up for seven minutes, get the heart rates going, get the blood pumping, and then we will get going, okay. So, here we go. Right, stand in the middle of your mat. Take your arms, stretch them right up above your head. Big stretch, suck in those belly buttons. And I want you to slowly take the one arm back, right arm back, bring it to the top, left arm back, bring it to the top. Just keep alternating, nice and slowly. And I want you to rotate that upper body. Is somebody else coming in? Rotate that upper body backwards, swing it around. Okay, nice and steady. Just make sure each time you can reach. So reach that arm up when you get to the top. And when you've completed, go forwards this time. So rolling it forward, turning the arms over. Slowly start picking up a bit of pace. Just rotate that upper body, that torso. You can turn your hips a little bit. Just rotating. Right, and bring it to the top. Big reach up, push up onto your toes. And exhale, take it down, reaching down towards your hands. I mean towards your feet. Right, you're reaching down towards your feet. I want you just to start lifting those heels. Lifting the heels, lifting the, lifting the knees. Walk it out. Keep bent over. Oh, don't forget to start your watches. Right, let's place your hands on the ground and let's walk your hands forward, walk them forward, walk your feet backwards, take it up into a plank position and now walk your feet forwards towards your hands, keep yourself folded over, now walk your feet back slowly, slowly, little steps, somebody needs to mute their feet back walk arms back, roll it up, right, hands go back down, Just um, Mark and Jacques, I think, okay, Jacques, you're on mute, Mark, I think you need to mute your microphone, there's a bit of noise coming through, right, hands back down to the ground, walk your hands out, so walk it out, walk it out, come to a plank position, Lower yourself slowly to the ground. Hold yourself just off the ground. Push yourself back up. Walk your feet slowly towards your hands. Stay in a folded over position. Walk your feet slowly backwards. Bring yourself back to a plank position. Lower yourself slowly to the ground. Push yourself back up. Walk your hands slowly back towards your feet. And slowly roll yourselves up. Take those arms up, big stretch up. And release, shake it down. Right, shake out your legs, shake out your arms. We're going to step back. So, hands in front of you. Step back, drop the knee. Step forward, step back. Drop your knee to the ground. So actually bring it to a rest. Step forward. Step back. Put the knee on the ground. Step forward. 
Back, knee on the ground, step forward. Right, two more. Bring it up, right, stand here, big step back, don't drop the knee, lift the knee up, step it back, lift the knee up, step it back, two more, last one, foot back down, right, step the left leg back, knee up, step back, knee up, keep that leg straight behind you, you don't have to bend it back. Just nice and straight, it's a big reach. One more. And release, right, shake out the legs. Shake out the arms. Interlock your hands behind your back, like this. Breathe, put your feet shoulder width apart. Nice big inhale. And exhale, fold it forward. Opening up that chest, stretch your hands towards the ceiling. While you're in this folded over position, slowly turn your feet out a little bit more. Turn them out, turn them out, take them quite wide apart. Release your hands towards the floor. And now we're gonna go side to side. So both feet to your left. I mean both hands to your left. Both hands to your right. Both hands to left. Both hands to right. Right, keep going. Keeping it low, nice and steady. Just get some mobility. Right. Now I want you back to the left. I want you to take it up, reach it up and over, and bring it down. Take it up, reach it up and over, bring it down. So straightening those legs, bringing it down, reaching those arms up, feeling that upper body twist. Move, getting mobility into the whole trunk area, into the shoulders. Right, let's do two more. One, two, bring it down, walk your hands to the middle. Walk your hands as far away from you as you can, stretch it out. And slowly walk your hands back to the center and roll yourselves up. Right, shake out arms, shake out legs. Let's get going. So, push-ups, this is what you need to do. You've got 30 seconds, so 30 seconds of push-ups. You can either do the full push-up, modified push-up, with your knees on the ground, or you can just do baby cobra. So just take your hands out, pushing yourself up, back down. So this is the modified one for if you battle to lift your body weight, or you can lie yourself 100% flat, and slowly just roll yourself up, okay? So right, let's go, we're doing 30 seconds. Are you ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Pace yourself, nice and easy. Don't brace it off. Halfway. Three, two, one, right, come up, squatting, feet shoulder width apart, straight into it, down and up, down, up, one minute, this is one minute, so keep it going nice and steady, use your arms, so making sure you're pushing your bum backwards, getting it to the back, Knees don't go over your toes. So bum back, look up straight, keep a flat back, keep it going. Use your arms to help counter stabilize yourself. Stabilize yourself. <laughs> right, so we've got 15 more seconds, and then we're going straight into alternating lunges. So straight forwards. So make sure your feet are shoulder width apart. Three, two, one. Bring it up, hand on your side. Straight forward. So plant your foot flat. Distribute your weight across your whole foot. Keep your bodies upright. 
Nice big step forward, dropping that back. Right, halfway, three more seconds. So, key here, breathe in, blow out, breathe in, blow out, breathe in, blow out. So on your workload, you blow out. Right, we've got 10 seconds. We're going to upper plank, knees to elbows. So, walking them in, three, two, one, hands down. Walking them in, focus on your breathing. Right knee to right elbow, left knee to left elbow. Suck in those bellies. If this becomes too much for you, drop your knees down and just do knee to elbow. Try to keep it up, it's only 30 seconds. You've got five, four, three, two, one, rest. Right, sit up, shake it out, have a drink of water. So, pace yourself, we've got two more sets like that, so you can pick it up a little bit more. We're going again, push-ups. You know what push-ups you need to get done? We're going in, are you ready? So, three, two, one, let's go. Push-ups. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one, up squats. Setting it back. Nice and easy. So, what do you feel here? So you want to feel the exercise as opposed to just doing the exercise. So, feel your feet planted to the mat, all your toes in contact with that mat. Bum goes back, reaching those arms forwards. Quads, so squeezing the glutes when you come back up. 20 more seconds. Making sure your knees stay over that big toe behind it. So push, 10 more seconds, we're going to lunges. Three, two, one, here we go. Straight into it. Plant the foot, drop the back knee. Make sure those upper bodies are upright, push it back, bring your feet together, Linda, try to push yourself all the way back, bring your feet together at the back. Remember, body stays upright, you bend that back knee, try to keep a bit of a 90 degree bend in the back knee, 90 degree bend in the front. 10 more seconds, plank, knees to elbow for 30 seconds, 3, 2, 1, right knee to right elbow, left knee to left elbow, suck in those bellies, activate the core, you just threw halfway, Three, two, one, rest, push it back. You can go into child's pose, dropping your head, focus on your breathing. You got 20 more seconds.
How are you all doing? Thumbs up, everyone okay? Are you ready? We've got one more round like that. And then we're going to mix it up again. Right, here we go. Push-ups. Three, two, one. Hop. Halfway. Three, two, one, squats. Set it back. So be careful here as you tire, you don't start pushing your knees forward. Bum goes back, up, bum back, feet planted into the mat, knees stay track, big toe, twenty more seconds. Right, so we're going to transition straight into lunges. Get ready in three, two, one. Here we go. Body's upright. Drop that back knee. Twenty more seconds. There we go. Back down to plank. Sucking those bellies in. Controlled. Knee to elbow. If staying in plank is too difficult, then lower your knees down and continue with the exercise. In three, two, one. Here we go. Breathe in. Blow out. Breathe in. Blow out, breathe in, blow out, breathe in. Three, two, one, rest. Stake it down, stretch it out. How are you doing? Is everyone okay? Right, so that's the first round down. Get ready. We're going to start the second round. Same setup. First exercise is a jump lunge. So from here, just control it. 30 seconds. Are you ready? Bring it up. Three, two, one. Let's go. So we're going to go to a bicep curl after this. So your elastic band or dumbbells will be good. If you only got one, I'll tell you when to change. Right, four, three, two, one. Grab your elastic, grab your dumbbells, feet a little bit more wide apart. Bicep curls. Squeezing it up, slowly down. Squeeze, slowly down. So if you've only got one dumbbell, and you need to change, in three, two, one, swap arms. Right, so straight from here, we're going to try some kickbacks. So we're loading the arms for two minutes, nice and steady, squeezing 
squeeze at the top. Hold it for a second, just under. But you really want to feel that bicep work. All right, three, two, one. Take it forward, kick it back. Keep those elbows tucked to your sides. Elbows don't move. Head looks straight down. If you've got an elastic, you should be still standing on it. Kicking it right back. Hold it for a fraction at the back. Halfway. So if you need to swap, swap arms. Swap the weight. So we're going to a half squat hold for 30 seconds. Off the back of this. 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Put it down. Right, so come straight down. Hands in front of you. Sit it back. Come on, Kapil, stop daydreaming. Linda, get down, get down. It's only 30 seconds. Hold it, you've got 30 seconds recovery after this. Suck in those bellies. Track the knees straight on top of toes. Keep it here. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. Grab a drink. Right, back to jump lunges. If the load was too great with the dumbbells, use the elastic for the second set, okay? Right, jump lunges, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Control it. If this is too much for you, then just do a standard alternating lunge. Less stress on the joints, but otherwise all us runners fit healthy. Not pregnant. 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Right. Bicep curls. Straight into it. Body's upright. Soft knees. Feet shoulder width apart. Curl it up. Squeeze at the top. Turn your pinky into your shoulder. Hold it just for a second. Feel the exercise. Breathe in on the way down. Breathe out on the way up. In, out. In, out. Turn the Pinky towards the shoulder. You got 10 more seconds. Then we're going to try some kickbacks. Three, two, one. Pivot forward. Tuck elbows in. Push. Push. So keep the elbows tucked tightly to your side. Stretch it back. Breathe in to release, breathe out to squeeze and hold. Breathe in, release, breathe out, squeeze and hold. Elbows don't leave your side. You want to hold it for a fraction, keep it at the back. Halfway if you need to swap. So we're going to half squat hold, 30 seconds. You need to get to this as soon as you can. No hanging around, drinking a cup of coffee. Go straight into the move, all right. So we've got 10 more seconds. Squeeze those tries, squeeze them. Three, two, one. Just release, go straight in, straight in, come on. Try to sit it back, try to keep your back upright. Suck in those bellies, lift yourselves up. Use your hands for counterbalance.
Ten more seconds. Three, two, one. Relax. Shake them out. Right, so please make sure you're drinking water, relaxing, shake out the legs, shake out the arms. We got 15 more seconds, so either jump lunges or normal lunges, depending on how strong you're feeling. If you use the elastic, now try to go back to the weight. Last round, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Remember, you work at your own pace. Control it. Focus on that exercise. Push. Halfway. Three, two, one. Bicep curls. Here we go. Sucking those bellies in. <coughs> Knee soft, curling it up, blow out, breathe in, blow out, pinky into shoulder, control your breathing, your heart rate should be up through the roof, so big breath out, Deep breath in, breathe out, in. Fifteen more seconds. We got to try set kickbacks. Right, three, two, one. Pivot forward. Suck that belly in. Blow out. Breathe in, blow out, breathe in, tuck elbows to your sides. Try to relax the shoulders in this scenario. Too often we tighten up the shoulder blades and the shoulders and screw up the neck muscles, relax them, try to push your hands down away from you as you squeeze it up to the top, you got 15 seconds, squeeze those tries, slowly down, three, two, one, release, half squat straight into it, come, Get down, come. Just holding it. 15 more. Three, two, one. Relax. Shake it out. Grab a drink. Sorry, Kitty. <laughs> right. So, some options here. 30 seconds. So, you're going to go behind, lift yourself up, one leg at a time for 30 seconds. If you battle with that, sit up straight and just lift the leg straight. Here we go. Three, two, one, take it up. So control these, blow out, breathe in, blow out, breathe in, try to push your butt up, try to keep your body in a straight line, five more seconds, three, two, one, down, bend the knees, bridges, so hands to your side, blow out, squeeze up, slowly down, blow out, suck your belly in, squeeze up. Slowly down, nice and steady, your pace. Breathe in to recover, blow out, 
Suck that belly, belly in, squeeze those glutes. Push it up, slowly down. Push it up, slowly down. Control the breathing, you're halfway. Ten more seconds. Right, we're going to squat ab twist. Three, two, one, stand up. So, up, hands behind your head. Squat down, bring it up, twist. Squat down, bring it up, twist. Down, up, twist. Down, up, twist. Thirty more seconds. Right, so we're going for a thirty second knee toe touch reverse plank. So watch, I'll show you now. Three, two, one, up. Knee, toe, touch. <laughs> knee, toe, touch. Knee, toe, touch. Knee, toe, touch. Knee, toe, touch. Opposite arm to leg. <laughs> Ten more seconds. So put that weight on that arm. Three, two, one, rest. Stretch it out. Good job. So that, that last time was a little bit tricky. You'll learn how to balance out your weight. 15 more seconds, rounding up again. So, reverse plank like this. Either seated, blowing out, or take it up. Here we go, three, two, one, hop. It's not about speed, it's about feeling those muscles working, feeling the exercise, not just doing the exercise. Feel it. Three, two, one, bridges, bend the knees, back down. Fist distance between the knees, pushing it up, breathing it in, pushing it up, breathe it in. Remember you're working at your own pace. Plant your feet onto the mat. Can you feel your toes, all five of them, pushing into the mat? Can you feel that heel push into the mat? Can you feel those glutes firing as you push yourselves up? Can you feel those hip flexors extending, lengthening out, sucking in those bellies, activating that core? Hold time, you need to feel all those muscles. Are they working? What are they doing? Three, two, one, up. Squat up, twist, hands behind your head. Squat it down. Opposite knee to elbow. Squat it down. That's it, come on. Guys are doing a good job. So you wanna bend that knee. Bring it in, keep it bent, lift it up.
10 more seconds. So knee toe touches at a reverse plank, keeping those knees bent. Three, two, one, down. So up, knee, toe, touch, knee, toe, touch. Sit up tall, suck in those bellies, focus on your breathing, open up those hip flexors if you need to, drink some water, one more round, and then we're going to ab round, core round. Right, we've got five more seconds from now, legs straight out, hands behind you, three, two, one, up. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one. Bridges. Bum down. Here we go. Blow out. Squeeze it up. Breathe in. Blow out. Squeeze it up. So when you blow out, try imprint that spine curling that tailbone under pushing it up towards the ceiling when you recover a little arch in that lower back flat on the mat and then to push up close that arch down push that tailbone up squeeze those glutes you really want to suck that belly in and activate those glutes squeezing them 15 more seconds Keep it up, everyone. Three, two, one. Right, squat, twist. Here we go. Down, up, twist. Down, up, twist. So be careful when you put your hands above your head, you incline to pull your body forwards. We don't want you to pull your body forwards. Concentrating, looking forward, keeping focus on a mark on the wall. Looking up slightly, it'll help keep your back flat, flatter while you're doing this. So, squat, back, push, squat, lift, twist, squat, lift. Come on, less than 20 seconds to go. Right, reverse plank, knee toe touches, coming up in 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Here we go. So focus. Weight onto arms and leg. Evenly distribute it. Lift that knee, lift that foot. Get the touch in. Three, two, one, rest. Well done, everyone. So that was the big workout done. We're gonna do about six minutes of some abs, and then we'll do a little stretch, and then we're done. How are you all feeling? Woohoo! <laughs> all right, hopefully you should have got all your points. Right, I want you to lie on your side. So, lie like this, put your arms straight up, hands on your side, rest your head down, and I want you just to slide. Nice and easy, 
slot that hand down your thigh, down your ITB, just crunching it up, blowing it out, sucking in those bellies, keep it going, five, four, three, two, one, and relax, right, so now, tuck your arm in underneath you, so make sure you've got a straight line here, those of you who can, take it up, and go for 20 seconds like this, those who battle, stay down, and just do slide pun, abductor, so just pick it up, taking it away, abducting, three, two, one, relax, right, swap over, other side, lying down, flat on your side, 20 seconds, just sliding it down, here we go, so keep that body nice and straight, you should be lying on your side, sliding your hand down your ITB, 10 more seconds. So three, two, one, relax, tuck the elbow in. So those of you who battle with lifting yourself up, you can put your hand in front of you here if you want to assist or stay down and lift. Here we go, taking it up, nice and easy. Side plank with a side lift, 20 seconds. 10 to go, Three, two, one. take it down, right, lying on your backs, take your legs straight up in the air, so crunch yourself up, lifting your shoulders and your head just off the ground, and arms up, and a little reach, just alternating, each side, we're going to just go for 30 seconds, Nice and easy, your pace, keeping that bottom part of your back flat onto the mat. I just want you to reach and twist, you want to get into those obliques, suck in that transverse, keep that back flat, keep it going. Three, two, one, relax, put your knees into your, hip, into your chest, round the back. Slowly bring your feet down to the ground, and I want you to roll yourselves up nice and slowly. Keep yourselves nice and upright. Keep those knees in close here. Put your arms straight out in front of you. Keep the back flat, and slowly, slowly lower yourself to the mat. Nice and slowly. When we hit 10, I want you to be flat. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and relax. Reach arms up over your head. Stretch your legs out in front of you. Stretch it out. Drop your head back. Bend your knees in. Keep your knees bent about a fist gap from your bum, your heels. Bring your hands down next to your body. And for 10, we're slowly going to roll up. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And see if you can take your arms up. 10. Woohoo! Right, bring it back down onto your side. Straight out in front of you. Hands on top of your ITB. Crunching it up. 30 seconds, so you want to try to stay as flat and as straight as you can, and from now, here we go, slide your hand down your ITB, just pushing it, so you want to feel it get into right into your obliques here, you want to suck your belly in, keep a nice flat stomach, nice flat abs, activate your transverse, sucking your belly towards your spine, you want to make sure that spine stays stable, and focus on crunching that oblique, bringing it up, go as far as you can comfortably go, 
three, two, one, rest, right, up onto your side, so those you want to stay here, you can stay down like that and just lift sideways for 20 seconds, otherwise let's lift, taking it up, Ten more. Three, two, one, relax. Right, flop over. Other side. Arms straight out, rest your head, hands by your side. Here we go. Three, two, one, slide it up. Three, keep it going. Three, two, one, relax. Once again, making sure your elbow is directly underneath your shoulder. You want to come, come up, otherwise lying on your side. Here we go. Two, one, up. 20 seconds, nice and steady. Ten more. Three, two, one, and relax. Right, bring it back down. Lying on your back, arm, legs straight up to the ceiling. So crunch it up, head and shoulders just off the mat. Arms up, and a little twist. Here we go, 30 seconds, let's go. So just reach. Don't crunch up, don't try to lift yourself higher off the mat. You've already activated that transverse and that core. You're sucking the belly in. You just want to do a little reach. So a little oblique. You're just you're using your obliques just to give you that little twist. You don't want to put strain on that lower back. If you've got too much strain, bend your knees slightly. And you can twist like that. Otherwise, try to keep them straight up. Three, two, one, and relax. Bring it down. Sit up nice and tall. Right, this is our last one. So we're going to do a count of 10, lowering yourself to the ground. Push your arms straight up above your head. So I want you to suck your belly in. Keep your arms in line with your ears if you possibly can. Relax the neck. And on a count of 10, slowly going down. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Reaching it back, straightening out your legs, pushing your hands as far away from you as you can, pointing your toes as far away from you as you possibly can. Stretch it out. And release. Right, slowly bring your arms down to your side. So put a 90 degree bend in your elbows, making sure your, um, your arms guarded. Yeah. Right angles. Cactus arms. So have cactus arms, that's a good idea. So you want to try and get your hands and your forearms flat on the ground. So see if you can get your arms flat on the ground. And with your arms and forearms, hands put on the ground, slowly, slowly reach your arms up above your head, straightening it up, pushing up towards us as far away from as you can, stretch it out, and keeping your hands, forearms, everything still flat against the floor, slowly bring your arms back towards cactus arms. And release. So rotate your hands forward, bend one knee in, your left or your right, up to you. Grab hold of your knee, pull your knee into your chest. So whichever leg you've pulled in, so if you've pulled in your left leg, take your left hand, grab hold of your knee, take your right hand, grab hold of your ankle, 
And then just pull that ankle up towards you, squeezing that knee into your chest. So left knee goes to left chest. Pulling it up, pulling that ankle across. And release, slowly taking the leg back and slowly bringing in your other leg. This time, if you did your left, you're doing your right. Pull with both hands, pull that knee into your chest, just relax the back into the mat, just relax the shoulders, holding onto that leg. Right hand to right knee, left hand to right ankle and pulling that right knee to your right chest. Pull your ankle, your right ankle across to your left. Nice and steady. Focus on your breathing, melting into the mat. And slowly release that leg. Straightening that leg out in front of you, just shake out the leg side to side. Slowly bringing both knees in, up to your chest, bring them both up. Wrap your arms around, tuck your head in between your knees and just give yourselves a little rock side to side. Relaxing your head back towards the mat, slowly release your arms and just roll over to your left side, letting your right arm go out to the right and fold over, looking to your right hand, rolling your left knees, your knees over to your left. And using your left arm to help bring up your left knees, bring them up, use your right arm, wrap it around your left, your knees. Left arm goes out to the side, slowly, slowly roll yourselves over to the right. Looking through to the left hand. Stretching it out. Using your right hand, roll your knees back up to your chest. Wrapping yourself and sitting up. Putting your heels, feet to the mat. Pushing yourselves back. Straightening out your legs, lowering yourself, reaching your arms up towards the ceiling. Big reach forward, stretching out those hamstrings. Two, one, push ups. <laughs> and slowly, slowly releasing. Slowly walking your hands up, rolling your spine up, lengthening out that spine. Take those arms up. Big reach up, reach all the way to the ceiling, and exhale, slowly bring your hands down, and relax. Well done, everyone.